Hey there everybody, welcome back to a brand new episode of Let's Retro Monster Rancher Advance 2. So just to give a quick update on the Let's Retro series, unfortunately Shining Force will be on hold probably until Tuesday, maybe Thursday, depending on how much I get done because I, I like a dummy, accidentally saved over the save file I was actually playing in, so the only save file I have left now is the one where <laughs> it was before Michelle's castle. So now I'm all the way back there and I have to go through all that work again. It was like three more battles after that, so I gotta go through all that again. But I digress. That's not that big a deal. Gives me a chance to get those rings that I missed. So I'll get all that stuff back. But it will take me some time. Now, what we're gonna do in today's episode, because I'm not sure what I wanna do. If I wanna push through all of the S-rank stuff now, or get the money to actually build up my my uh, barn so that way I can get you know dragons and stuff like that because now I can actually get a dragon I can also now get a Durahan and a Joker because I have the black spear so I just got to go through that stuff to see what I can actually create so I also want to see if I can get Gara some new moves but for that, I want the money, and to get the money, I gotta go through the battles. To get through the battles, I wanna, you know, do my thing. But what I'm gonna do is, Gara, since he's three years and three months, uh, come three years, five months, I'll put him in storage. I'll let him rest. So, he'll do this tournament and go through that month. I'm tempted to do the, the Strongman Cup one as well, and then I'll just let him rest for that, for the rest of it. So that that way I can work on the Dragon and the Durahan and get them all up to S rank as well. And that way, in case Gara, you know, can't make it all the way through S-Rank, I don't have to start all the way from zero again. So, we're going to go ahead and train this week. Actually, let me see. What do I want to do? Do I need to train him a little? Uh, not too bad. I'm going to see if I can get the power up to level 9. So, I'm going to see if I can get power, speed, and defense to level 9. Or at least to 400 all around. Let's see if we can do that. Good job, Gara. Power went up by 12, so I should be over 400 now. Gara's looking lively. I'm liking it. I think he's over 400 power, right? Oh, I'm too short, really? Alright. There we go. Alright, nice. 411, or 400 and change power. So we're going to rest this week. We're going to do the Dignity Cup. See if we can beat that. So this way we can actually get some cash. Hmm. Give him some uh, good old meat and potatoes. There we go. Good job, Gara. Hey there. Working hard. Kevin, what brings you here? I brought somebody interesting today. Hey, come here. Huh? Hey, it's been a while. Hunter, where have you been? Sorry about disappearing after claiming to be your rival. Actually, we... Kevin, let me tell them. Well, after fighting Canute, I was completely disgusted with myself. I took off and traveled for a while. Then I ran into Gavin by chance. We talked a lot about Canute, about you guys, and about Hunter himself. And I decided to start all over again. With me. What? Why? Well, the kid stinks and I like that. Oh, brother. But seriously, I was impressed with his passion for battle. Plus, if I teamed up with him, we could try to beat Canute and you. What fun. That's your real reason, right? Anyway, this is not the same hunter you knew. We came here to ask a tomb for a favor. Would you battle me? Hunter! Ever since I decided to start over, I've been knocking myself out training now. Well, I want to see if I improve. It's okay, isn't it a tomb? Alright, Hunter. I appreciate it. Here I go, then. Wait, here you go. What do you mean, you? And now you also have a Gara species. Holy 500s! Oh, I'm, I'm going to get... De oh, no. He, oh, and I can't control Gara. Oh, this is, this is bad. Oh, this is so bad. Gara, come on. Come on, Gara. Gara, Gara. Hit him. Stop using Wild Slash. Stop using Wild Slash. I want you to use Fire Upper. Oh, I can't do anything. Oh, this is hurting my soul. Gara. 
third time? Really? Come on, Gara. Come on. Stop. Stop. Stop with the wild slash. You've tried that move three times. Four times now. Sorry. Four counters. Gara, what are you doing? Oh my god. Gara's gonna lose. Because Gara's an idiot who keeps doing the same move. Is this a scripted battle? Is this a, is this like I have to lose? Because his HP alone would demolish mine. Holy Gar, you couldn't even hit him once. Oh, that is depressing. Gara, holy Jesus, Gara. Surprise? That was a move we created called the Slam Back. Slam Back? It's our own original. Nobody else can do it. Thanks to you, we came to see our own ability. I guess that's enough for today. Sorry it was so sudden. But our goal is now still to defeat you guys. Don't forget that, you hear? Well, see ya. H how Hunter has gotten a lot stronger both mentally and physically. We had to catch up with them, Atum. I mean, what am I supposed to do? It's a counter that has a 100% success rate. That's like literally broken. Okay, we're, we're just gonna... Maybe it was just because of his training, and literally this tournament's actually doable. Battles are where monsters lay their pride on the line. This tournament is truly worth that much. This is where all the hard work pays off. Test yourself, let the Dignity Cup begin! A tomb, we gotta aim for the top. Of course. Daytona, Rand, Marine, Tyr, Kotetsu, Felicia, and Rex. Alright, here we go. I wanna see if I can- oh my gosh. I am super underleveled here. Oh, this is gonna be rough. Oh god. Dodge it. Oh yeah. Yikes. Oh yeah, I'm dead. <laughs> Alright, I might just have to put Gar in the freezer now, because I'm apparently very underleveled. I'm not even gonna attempt the S rank tournaments right now. Oh wow. Jesus, he two shotted me. Alright, and Daytona wins. Can I just leave the tournament now? I got destroyed. I should not have said that. Our Roman Zessa did come by today. We got a lot of visitors to me. Rank S. A two, Molly. Hello, you two. Congratulations on reaching rank S. A tomb, I always knew you could do it. Bro, stop trying to get in good with the tomb. Anyway, congratulations. Thanks. By the way, Hunter's back. Yeah, I know. He destroyed us the other day. I heard he entered a tournament right away and won every single match. Wow, we'll have to work really hard, right, a tomb? Now that a tomb is rank S and Hunter's back, I can't wait to fight both of you. Huh? Rank S means we're going to meet sometime in battle. Wait. You're rank S? <laughs> you breeders, you breeders too. <laughs> what was I thinking? We're seated, so if we meet, I think it's going to be after the official championship. Do your way to win up the official S. And we won't go easy on you. See you then. <laughs> what a good way to say goodbye. Oh, man. Oh, what? Things have gotten interesting indeed. Oh god, it's Canute. Canute, how long have you been there? For a fighter, a challenge is always good. Phoenixes are said to burn themselves to nothing, only to be born again. Hunter has re re <laughs> Hunter has been reborn like a phoenix. Can you beat him? But your challenge will not only be him. Meet your challenges head on. I'll be waiting for you beyond that. You try to sound cool. He vanished again. Things are getting intense, Atum. Let's try to conquer the official rank S. Yeah, not right now. Gara is really worn out. Yeah, no duh. The tournament crushed him. Alright, so I'm gonna put Gara. <sighs> Let me think. You know what? No, I'm not gonna put Gara away yet. Let's go ahead and do some of the side stuff that we can do. Because I, what I might do is I might make Gara into a trainer instead of fusing him into other ones and then helping him or letting him 
train the other monsters faster since he has such good stats. So let's go ahead and go to town. Let's see. For now, we're going to do expeditions. We're going to go on an expedition. The question is, which one do I want to do? All right, there's a monolith expedition, but that requires 400 intelligence. Can't do that. Ah, the... Hmm, I need to go to the Promius Ruins for that one. Golly is another 400 experience. We got the odd part from the Hanger side quest, I think. Malt Ruins. Off we go. So we're looking for the southeastern cylinder-shaped temple. Let's head this way. I said it's southeast, so it should be this way somewhere. Alright, let's bust through the barrier. Good job, Gara. Now, I have absolutely zero clue where I'm going right now. I'm just doing this as a blind run. This might be it, I guess. Yes. Some kind of machine. Good. We can do that at the studio. Gara is tired. Head back to the studio. Right, let's go ahead and talk to Kamwa. Oh, it's you, Holly. What's up today? Well, we found this, and we don't know what it is. We thought you might know. Let me take a look. Hmm, I've never seen anything like it. Really? That's too bad. I wonder what it could be. Say, why don't I hang on to it for a while? I might remember something that'll help. Could you? That'd be great. Alright, so that should do it. And then apparently in two months, she'll come back. And... Oh, whoops, I did not mean to come back here. Thanks, buddy. Gara, back to the wrench. Gara can sleep. Apparently after two months, I gotta go back again, and I'll be able to produce a hanger. Alright, so now that Gara's there, let's go ahead and go to town. Let's go ahead and put Gara away for now. Question is, what monster do I want to have? I did not mean to hit revive, I meant to hit freeze. Thank you. Into a freeze capsule you go, Gara. Hmm. Let's see. Who do I want? Because obviously I can't do a dragon right now. Because dragons are too big. I can't do golems. They're too big. Can't do lesions because they're too big. Ooh, maybe I'll do uh, the scorpion guy I like. Where is he? Th this guy that, that made picked. I forgot his species. I don't know if they're too big to actually take with me. That or I can go with a wolf. A wolf would also be a really good choice. Let me think for a moment. Alright, I have no idea who I'm going to go with, so let's just go ahead and start inputting codes. Let's see what this gives me. Edgehog. Yeah, too big to fit in a barn, but thanks. Interesting, that's a naga. Aw, it's an octopi. Hmm, let's try another one. A juker. Let's see what we get. <gasps> it's the guy I wanted. Fire gear. Oh, it's too big to fit in the barn. Dang it. Ooh, an antlion. Oh, 
Oh, <gasps> skeleton. That looks cool. Oh, it's another skeleton. Let's see. 151 power, 135, same stats, same stats, same stats, same stats, same stats. High speed, tough skin, and success. Well, that one has an interesting one, so I'll take this one. Yes, I will take skeletons home. What shall I name you is the question. Hmm. Pepe virus. No. Pep virus. No. Hold on. There's a song that I'm look I'm thinking of right now. Ah, here we go. I found it. It's called Pavirus. Yeah, I'm gonna call you Pavirus. I like it. Let's go, Pavirus. So, meet our new monster, Pavirus. Ex great execution in battle, punch rush, smoke bomb. Alright, alright, I'm, I'm feeling it. Starts at decent, decent stats, actually. Question is, let's see what he actually is good at. For Antlands, it's actually power, accuracy, and defense are their three best stats. Everything else, eh, a little lackluster. So I'm gonna focus on power, accuracy, and defense for uh, Pavirus here. Let's go ahead and take him back to the ranch. Let's see what you can do. There's power training. Oh, you failed it, Pavirus. I'm gonna scold you real quick. Now, what should we feed you this month? What do you like to eat is the real question. Nothing in particular. Okay. That makes it easy. Oh, hey, it's a Yase. <gasps> Ooh, training sale, you say? Alright, well, that's good. Go ahead and try that out. Just to do it for yellow's sake. It'll be hard for you to learn a new move. That's fine. That is also fine. 800G? Why not? This is going to be an absolutely horrible idea. Because you have, like, no moves, buddy. And you're decked. <laughs> One shot. Awesome. Right, whatever power went up by 19. That's fine, I guess. And a new trait. Full beans. Alright, I'll uh, feed you fish, I guess. I don't know. Alright, time to rest. <laughs> His eyes. His eh, frisk face. Right, let's see what you got. I got tough skin, high speed. Makes it easier to increase the speed stat. Ooh, nice. Great execution in battle. Nice, nice. I'm liking it. Alright, Pavirus. I got all these guys. I like you, though. Like, you look really cool. 
Come on, you should have enough power to do this now. <sighs> okay. You know what? I think I'm going to make this episode a little shorter this time. Only because I don't want to bore you with a million training episodes of, like, for virus and stuff like that. So I'll let him train off screen. We'll go ahead and in the next episode, we'll have a virus set up really far. Hopefully if all goes well. But I'll leave the episode off here, guys. You know, we did get a new monster, so I got to let him, you know, do his thing. I'll get some money, upgrade the barns. I'll set out for that for the next episode of Let's Retro Monster Rancher Advance 2. Sorry the episode's short, guys. But, you know, I'm at least excited because, you know, this is the beginning of a new journey for Provirus and Gara. hopefully will do well as well in the future once we get the barn upgraded and you know diffuse him into other monsters when the time comes but other than that guys i will catch you here next time on let's stretch for monster rancher advance 2 if you like today's episode go to give it a thumbs up leave a comment down below hit the subscribe button if you aren't already part of the curly crew and i will catch you all here next time i hope you all have a great and wonderful day